Hey, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Down from the Down Show in France, and we're back for another K-pop reaction. And today, I'm going to be doing 17 Rock With You choreography video. Quick update. James is feeling better, so he'll be back soon. And then when he gets back, me, James, and Alani will be doing music videos. So we did not forget. We got those on the way. But today, we got 17 choreography video Rock With You, all right? So make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you share. Make sure you comment. Y'all know how we do. And then make sure you subscribe, all right? But other than that, I want actually want to get right into this because I actually want to enjoy this. Like when I soon as I seen the thumbnail, I was like, oh yeah. And I haven't heard a song rock with you that was whack. So I want to check this out right now. So let's go ahead and get into it. And three, two, one. Let's get it. Ah, let's see what they do. Yes. Patience. Uh huh. Okay. Let's see. Ooh, really groovy. Really groovy. Ooh. I like that. I like that. Okay. So. The second time the band had came out, that second, I want to go back to that. That whole sector right there was nice. Can we go back? Let's go back. Let's go back just a little bit. I'm going to go at 19 seconds. Okay, y'all ready? Let's do this. I like this part, but I love when the second, the second part of the band come out. I love the little slide down. Work with the arm combos, slide over. I like that, that was really smooth. Ugh. I just wanna love you, you hit the chest. <laughs> I would've did the same thing. Mm. I like this. I like this. A lot of footwork in this one. Oh, hey, 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 let's go, let's go. Did you see when, that, when they said, I want to rock with you? He said, hey, the band was getting that. So, um, let's keep it real. The first 45 seconds of this video was crazy. I'm just keeping on with y'all. It was absolutely crazy. Because that whole combination, if you go all the way back to like maybe 30 seconds, starting at 30 seconds, and you watch that all the way to 1 minute 17 seconds, that whole combination was nasty. There's so much to dissect from that because it's a lot of, if you look at like, if you back up, right, and you're on stage, and if you watch it where it's literally like a lot of lines and arms and legs, their footwork was nasty. Like for real, for real. Like if you go back right now to like, let's go, I'm going to start at 35, 36 seconds. Pay attention to more of the footwork, okay? Watch the slides. Watch their footwork. Like their upper body moving and work. They got the combinations. They moving with all that, right? But watch the legs. Watch the legs. Check this out. I love that. Watch how much footwork they about to put in. Ooh, with the elevation going up. Watch their feet. Leg work was nasty. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. You y'all see that? Y'all see that? Boom. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Hey, 17 don't play. Don't get it twisted. 17 don't play. I, I want to rock with you and roll out. Yeah. Let's go. Mmm. Ripple. Oh. Ooh. Let's see. Ugh. I'm gonna be honest. Like, if you go 10 seconds back, 
that the choreography so far, it ain't for the weak heart. Because the artist that's in the front, right? The artist in the front, he put in movement choreography with other group. And then he came into the center, did more movement, did more choreography, but they was bouncing off of him. Like he would do a move, then they would do a move, then they would follow up. As a dancer, even when I was a kid, when you when we try to do that stuff in like dance competitions, that stuff was hard to do because somebody will forget the movement and we would have to practice that for hours and hours and that part is not that's not easy. Growing up in Cleveland, we used to make choreography like that. Like I'm originally from Cleveland, Ohio. And when we used to do movements like that, we had to practice that a lot. No matter what song we did, it was very difficult because it would be like one or two people that would forget. After I do like an elbow, they would forget and it would kill the whole ripple. They had a ripple going diagonal. You feel what I'm saying? So shout out to Seventeen and shout out to the whole band because damn. Hey, smooth groundwork. Yeah, bring it back. I really respected the fact that when they had to do repetitive movements and they put a chorus, like they had to do that same little part, they still make sure that it's energy. And mind you, this is only dance practices. We're not even talking about the tour. Yes, I like that. I like that. We're not talking about the tour or award show or music video. This is just the dance practice. I love the setup that they have. Very three-dimensional, yes. Hey, hey, go deeper with that 17, stop playing. Ah, oh, I love that. I like this song too. Hey, come on. Hey, 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 hey. There we go. Way to work. Way to work. I love hard work. I love hard work. I love hard work. Hey. Good work, y'all. Good work, 17. Good work, 17. Hey, you know what? I say this. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell y'all my honest opinion why. I actually enjoy watching K-pop reactions. Like, let's forget all the hoop and hollering and the fake hype that y'all always see people do on YouTube, right? The reason why I like it is because I've been dancing since I was a little boy, okay? And I'm a grown man now, I'm a professor now, and I, and I have a blessing to teach others. And when I grew up, I loved watching bands and groups from around the world, like different music from the salsa music, from from West African music, from the hip hop, R and B, and I would see a group that got choreography, and it's always like really dope to see groups that's actually putting in time and choreography on stage and being explosive, but it's quality choreography. And K-pop brings that to the stage, like for real. Like all jokes aside, they really bring that to the stage. It's like when I watch Seventeen, when I Stray Kids. Blackpink, all of them, they always bring in choreography. Like they take that art form so serious to be on stage. And I just want to just make sure I just let y'all know like why I'm actually still doing these videos. It's because of the fact that I'm seeing them put in work. Like it's not somebody just standing on a mic and just like this. Nothing against somebody that does that because everybody doesn't like dancing. But the fact that when you watch a dance practice, they put in 13, 16 hours of time. And then when you listening, you also like the song, you feel me? And then you also recognize that you love the fashion and most importantly, you love the choreography. So for me to get up three or four o'clock in the morning to do these videos and I get to see some good choreography, I'm all for it. So that's why I'm still doing these videos because I actually genuinely enjoy this and it's teaching me some things too. Like you can always learn, keep that in mind. You can always learn. So. I wonder if this is going to be one of my favorite top 10 videos from 17. Um, at the end of the year, I'm going to let y'all know. Uh, me and the board, me and the bros, we're going to, you know what I'm saying, we're going to see what our top 10 is. But I actually really liked it Rock With You. And I never heard a bad song 
from any artist from any parts of the world that had a song called Rock With You. I haven't heard a bad one. I'm not gonna look for one either, but I actually enjoyed the song Rock With You and I definitely enjoyed this choreography. There's so much in this choreography that we probably would have been sitting here for about 20 minutes, but I definitely wanna say there were some parts that people are, are gonna probably miss out on. Like the part where he went up to the elevation, he went up like this, boom and sat. Now the only thing I would say is I wish that when they was doing the, the groove, when they was here, uh, I wish he would have stayed in this, and I wish they would have stayed in this just a little bit more. Just in my opinion, as a choreographer, I would have probably stayed in this a little bit more. I would have did something with that, but it's all good, though, because it's still, still a dope choreography, and it's a dope-ass song, too. So listen, let me know how you feel about this video, Rock With You. Um, I'm definitely going to be checking out more from Seventeen, so don't worry, uh, but... Yeah, I like this one. Definitely like this one. I, I was scared at first because if you watch the beginning, I saw one of the artists hit the uh, the wall and I seen like, I think that was like a flat screen. I was scared. I was like, oh man, hey, be careful. <laughs> because sometimes little incidents happen. You'd be like, boom, you hit the wall and then take you off your focus. But he stayed on top of it and camera just kept going. They kept putting that work. So respect to the band for real. But other than that, y'all, that's all I have for y'all. Please, there will be updates on the YouTube, so don't worry. We got new stuff coming, a new playlist coming due to y'all. Talk about that y'all love to watch me do some dance battles and choreography. I'm going to be doing those. And uh, what else, what else, what else? Oh, yes. And thank y'all so much for showing love to my dance videos that I kept on here. I had to remove a lot of them because of copyrights, but I've got some new work on there, so I'm going to put it on this page. But I'm going to do a poll because I want to make sure if I put it on this page, that y'all gonna watch because I wanna show y'all that I can really get down. I really can. And I wanna show y'all. And I wanna show you if you have, not show you, but if you have questions about movement, I wanna be able to put some information out there for y'all if you're learning dance and you wanna get involved with it. Because there's no way y'all are watching all these K pop artists, these bands, and y'all don't wanna dance. I'm talking to you fans. I know y'all be wanting to dance. And if it's some moves that you don't know how to do, I wanna be able to help y'all with that. Like, seriously. I want to help y'all with that. So talk to me, all right? I'm going to put some stuff out there. And if you got questions about movements, we might do a live stream where I might go over some moves that might help y'all. But time will tell, and we're going to take our time. We're going to build. But other than that, I'm going to get up out of here because I got to get ready to become a professor more. I got to get into from being a Don Show to a Professor Ice. So my students call me Professor Ice, and I am a teacher at The Ohio State University. But other than that, <laughs> I'm out of here, y'all. I got to get ready. I got to make sure all my stuff is ready to go. Love y'all. Take care. Take care of the mental. Take care of your heart. Take care of your soul and spirit. Peace.